Percy Shelley. Ode to a Skylark. Hail to thee, blithe spirit. Bird thou never wert, that from heaven or near it, polarist thy full heart, in profuse strains of unpremeditated art, higher still and higher, from the earth thou springest, like a cloud of fire, the blue deep thou wingest, and singing still dost soar in, soaring ever singest, in the golden lightning of the sunken sun, or which clouds are brightening, thou dost float and run, like an unbodied joy whose race is just begun. The pale purple even melts around thy flight, like a star of heaven, in the broad daylight. Thou art unseen, but yet I hear thy shrill delight. All the earth and air with thy voice is loud, as, when night is bare, from one lonely cloud. The moon rains out her beams, and heaven is overflowed. What thou art we know not, what is most like thee? From rainbow clouds there flow not, drops so bright to see, as from thy presence showers a rain of melody, like a poet hidden. In the light of thought, singing hymns unbidden, till the world is brought to sympathy with hopes and fears it heeded not. Teach us, sprite or bird, what sweet thoughts are thine, I have never heard. Praise of love or wine, that panted for the flood of rapture so divine. Chorus hymeneal, or triumphal chaunt, Match with thine, would be all, but an empty vaunt, a thing wherein we feel there, is some hidden want. What objects are the fountains, of thy happy strain? What fields, or waves, or mountains? What shapes of sky or plain? What love of thine own kind? What ignorance of pain? Teach me half the gladness That thy brain must know Such harmonious madness From my lips would flow The world should listen then As I am listening now